Hi everyone, it's Melanie from Living Luxuriously for Less and today I will be sharing with you some tips, tricks, and ideas on how to host a sports themed baby shower or birthday party. Stay tuned. Now, if you haven't already seen my previous video, a chit chat slash story time on how I almost ruined my reputation as an event planner, I would highly, highly recommend you watch that one along with the, um, how to host a surprise birthday party before you watch this video because this video will make so much more sense to you. So um, yeah, put this one on pause, go check those out and then come back to this one. This baby shower was held at the train depot in Tuscumbia, Alabama. Gorgeous picture by Jay Vandiver there. And I went on their website just to give you guys an idea of how huge their room is, this room was. Here is a whole entire train inside of the building. And here is how the building was set up the day before when my client and I visited it. Now, the next day, this is what the building looked like when we came back to get the shower um, in place and to start decorating for the shower. Huge, huge, huge building. Like I said, big enough for a train and it was completely empty and I wanted to do a different kind of design and so I found this inspiration photo on Google and my friend kind of drew it all out for me so I would know how many tables and chairs that were needed at each table and then for the centerpieces I absolutely love this um, Mickey Mouse centerpiece that I found on Pinterest and I wanted to create something similar but with what I wanted they weren't able to make that loop big enough for me my balloon artist and so they instead did this heart and it was absolutely perfect for what i needed because the height was wonderful are you finally ready for the reveal i sure am i can't wait to share this with you our balloon artists were able to create this gorgeous balloon swag that is really trending right now on Instagram and in party planning. And I thought it would be a really great place to place it in front of the mother and father to be. And then I did some you know, really cute decorations on the back of their chairs for him. I used a bow and for her, I used a tutu chair cover. And then here is how the room turned out. The hearts were perfect perfect for this particular room because there was so much space there's so much like headspace that I needed really large centerpieces now initially I was going to do like 25 of them but whenever they started building them they were so 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 big that I only needed five per table setup so yeah that turned out really great and it was a great cost saver and I was able to incorporate that swag now as for the balloon all that was was a vinyl transfer you can just place it on the balloon and peel it off and you can have a custom balloon in whatever theme you may choose and i thought it added so much character because their um, theme for the baby shower was our little mvp and i just thought that was so cute because they both played basketball and they wanted to play off of the whole basketball theme because they are a basketball family and i thought it turned out absolutely gorgeous In event planning, I am a stickler for details and this little printable made so much difference. Each printable was paired with the centerpiece and it really brought the theme all together. Now here is the dessert table and as always, it was so fabulous. The details in this dessert table was ridiculous. The little basketballs on the cake pops, on the little onesie, the MVP, the bottles, the MVP on the cupcakes, along with the floral aspect of it because we wanted to include the mom. So we added the flowers on the cake. Well, of course, Rachel did the cake. And she also went in and added flowers on the balloon swag that I showed you guys earlier to tie that theme all together you know when you're planning an event the important thing is to run the theme throughout the entire event through the desserts through every small detail and it will come together beautifully just like this shower I am so thankful that it came together so beautifully it was well attended and it was enjoyed by all the mother-to-be was grateful and I was certainly grateful to God 
Thank you all so much for watching this video. And until next time, it's Melanie with Living Luxuriously for Less. Cheers. And if you would like to see more photos of the shower, be sure to visit my Facebook page at Living Luxuriously for Less. Have a great weekend.